it's a nice Saturday morning here at the Plus Fitness Club North and I am getting in a quick session before race day. Uh, tonight we're running, with, oh, I think it's more this afternoon than tonight. Uh, we're running the big bad Virginia Speedway if you want to call it that. Uh, it is like, I think it's about like 700 metres or 650 metres I measured so that's about a 3.8 miles, nearly half. Um, for the American guys following. Uh, it's the biggest track I've run on by far. Uh, and it's flat. Uh, from my research, it's flat, long straights, tight corners. So it's gonna be pretty um, different experience. So I'm keen to see how I go on it. Uh, so yeah, I'll smash this gym session out. Uh, probably clean up my face a bit. Once again, got me fuzz back. It's a bit grotty, but it is what it is. And then yeah, we'll get on the road. What do you reckon? Did she take, how much did she take? Oh, I probably wouldn't. Oh, yeah. Not a heap. It's hard to wipe when he does. You bring it down here and you just drive it in there and you just smoke it sideways. Yeah. You want to drive past it, pitch it? And... Yeah, yeah. Right, so I'll be dry on the bottom here. Eh? What you might have to do is sort of get inside and sort of make sure that you get to that big gate there, that's how you, otherwise you'll be over yourself coming off. Mm, that looks like it give you much up here. Yeah, not much up here, mate, no. It's not bank terrible. It's very flat though. Huh? Long way from the river, yeah. Long way from the river, you think? <laughs> Maybe not just there. What it does is it actually like delaminates, what I noticed, and then like here in the center, and then it sort of just has slick exits and entries. So, let's see what this bottom is like. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, nah, yeah, nah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, nah, nah. She's dry. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> Looks like a good bit of tracks up here and I hope that's how it stays. Alrighty, here at Magunya Speedway, I've had a look at the track and yeah, she's big. Um, dialed in, ready to go. Uh, I drew a pole, which is not very un um, usual for me. I usually draw like a 80 or something like that, but I drew eight today and that was enough for the pole for heat one. So pretty keen to get out there, uh, give it a go and see, stretch legs out. This joint's huge, as you saw probably want me a little track preview. <laughs> Done dusted, that was terrifying. Um, this joint has no traction, it's flat as absolute all buggery, and yeah, you pretty much gotta stop the thing on a dime for a tight corner, and it's pretty long too. So, we got the win, but I wasn't comfortable, and we probably just gotta screw with it and get just a bit more comfortable with the running gas again on the car. So, just gotta get a bit more lazy and let it roll through the corner rather than just snap in on the brakes because the brakes are body too. But, yeah. And, yeah, we just got to uh, see the track prep. It was pretty much about to lay rubber. And it was just sand above it. There was really nothing you could grab. Uh, and then there was just holes galore in the middle where the sedans all loaded up and stuff. So, yeah, we'll check out what the track's doing. We're trying to knock the holes out, but I think the water was more the problem than the holes. I didn't mind the holes. It actually gave you a bit of traction. There was a nasty one right there. But, look, it's just like a driveway. And 
Yeah, it's it's not too bad getting in here. It's just so loose. You can't. You sort of skate across the top of it, and it's everywhere. So it's either slick or rough. That's what it was. But you know what? A little bit of duck spot over there too, which I should mention. We'll just send it and let her eat because it's a bit more timid than last time. But we'll see if this top line stays in. We had a bit of a disappointing second heat. I didn't even video about it. I was that mad. Yeah, the track was really one lane and dirty. Like, so it was like pretty much this. I'll give a good demonstration. It was pretty much like that. It felt like offline. It was just clean on the bottom, if that. And then, yeah, final I thought it was going to be sort of the same. So we tightened it right up. Um, just let all the weight transfer. And so, yeah, we just got the weight down, just easing into the gas off exit, and just picked them off one by one. We started out of fourth. And yeah, can't thank. Boys enough at all, and their dad's up there putting guys up. Bailey's here, worked him, worked his ass off, honestly. And yeah, we just picked him off. Lap Travi, we got uh, we got uh, Troy Little leader. Um, he sort of I think got in a bit of a tussle with the lap car, but we got a bit impatient too. He made me pretty much gain half a straight. And uh, yeah, we caught him, got past. We just went where he wasn't, got past him, and then the yellow come out, and I was mad, thinking, oh, the yellow come out, we're going to put us back again. And nah. That was it, we got the lead and this sort of took set sail and I can't believe it, I got away with the dirt mod tyre. So dirt mod tyres usually don't run here on the wingless because they're too hard, but this joint was really abrasive tonight, so didn't even knock the edge off it. So we're wrapped with that and yeah, hopefully we'll come back here and uh, they'll throw a couple of tyres towards the sprint car now. <laughs> 